All right, so in, the reason why racism still exists is because of two things. Uh, the first thing is basically because from childhood, you are programmed or children are programmed to believe in certain propaganda. Yeah, they're miseducated in the main, in the in, in like cartoons and all that stuff. There now, kids are you know with them their young minds. They just they just want to have fun, watch TV, or watch cartoons, play. They don't they don't really care about that stuff there. But then they end up playing out that that energy there when they go to school or go to play schemes or go to the park and all that stuff there. That's why you know you receive some six year olds or some seven year olds. Um, you know, saying or doing racist stuff because they see it in TV or mainstream media or whatever. And even as they get older, what happens? It's the same thing, that like there's racist propaganda that is pushed in the mainstream media. So, and if you're not teaching children how to be critical thinkers and you're not teaching about um, real story, I don't like to call it history, but real story because, you know, look, there's so many people, yeah, that have contributed to you know life or the the way the world works and all that stuff there and from centuries ago to even the past 10 15 years um but yeah like if you look at it you know i i can't remember the pacific details but krs1 has already said it in a song i should have been, been more prepared to know what the song was, was called but he said it in the song and this was i think this is back in the early 90s and um yeah, he mentions about the person who actually came up with the idea of um, um, the social constructs of black and white. So we need to eradicate that. Yeah. So as long as we, we eradicate that, we can remove racism. Now, will prejudices still exist? Possibly, yeah. Because at the end of the day, it don't, it's not just based on... Um, yeah, I'm going to say sometimes it is based on how you look, but... Uh, uh, it's techie, isn't it? It's techie, it's techie. But I will just say, yeah, the only reason, not that's the only reason, what you need to do, yeah, is focus on positive energy, focus on what you can do to help eradicate racism if that's what you want to do, yeah? Um, and I would recommend, if you click the link in the description box below, where it says become a member of the Akibulan Trust, you will get access to online courses such as roles and relationships. Now, um, in that course there, whether you're a man or whether you're a woman, let's say you're a man, you would have to develop yourself as a, a far-bred alpha male and know your role as a man, yeah? And if you're a woman, you don't have to develop yourself as a, a pure feminine woman and know your role as a woman, yeah? These, these traits are naturally within, in you anyway, yeah? There's that, then you get to course to do with um, career and business, so you learn exactly what your true personalized mission on earth is and why that's important yeah, it's also also called your pur uh, purpose, but like why that's important is because it will allow you to to know exactly what your true passion is and your true talents are and with the true skills that you have, so you can use that to help eradicate racism and all that stuff. There. Um, also, the other thing is uh, to do with African and Caribbean history, so you learn more to do with African and Caribbean history and all that stuff. There, that's plain and simple. And then also to do with healthcare, yeah, where you learn to strengthen your mental health because at the end of the day, when it comes to racism, whether you experience racism or whether you're, um, uh, whether you identify as white or whether you identify as Asian and you're now starting to witness, oh, this person is being racist or um, all that stuff there, you're seeing all these stuff and it can be very traumatic and all that stuff there. So it's having to learn how to make sure that your your mind is very well balanced yeah because yeah there is racism is beyond just you know the actions in terms of um yes yeah, it's, it's beyond the actions do you see what i mean it's it's mental it's, it's all it's all subconscious it's all subtle like man the britain is let me not say anything about britain let me just keep it simple all right, so yeah, that's pretty much it. So the link to to do to be able to get access to those courses, like I said, they're in the description box below. And if you've got any questions, any topics you'd like for us to discuss, leave that in the comment section below. 
And remember, hit the subscribe button and the bell notification because you never know the video you suggest might just be next. And also, before I even forget, you have to teach the children the right information from early as well. Yeah, because like I said before, if they are programming children's mind from an early, early age from when they watch cartoons, you have to hit you have to get them at that age too. Yeah? That's all I'm gonna say on that.